Wasabi Mountains. The beautiful mountains with the Dr. B following trees where they fall at a certain angle and at a certain slope. Then reigns the beautiful big nose Jorillas. In this Wasabi Mountain range, there are delicious Dr. B following trees like this one or that one, but look how the big nose Jorilla goes for the chunkiest root of the tree. Look at look at the Jorilla eat. Now as we see the big nose Jorilla starts drinking from the Yuhu chocolatey drink milk pond water and he enjoys it very much. And these big nose gorillas, they're very friendly to the. Oh. Oh. Sniper monkey. This is you, the island. Today I'll be going over the cities and other important things. We'll be interviewing all our leaders, starting off with Jamie, then Landon, then John. First, I'll be going over the map key Albuquerque. This is a reddish pinkish dot. Gibraltar. This is a purple dot. Palpaca Paca Peak is a dark blue dot. Plain Plains are the light blue lines. Cheeto Plateau are the orange lines. B Bay is the green dot. Whoville, the yellow dot. JDM, pink dot. Julio is the gray dot. Wasabi Mountains is the black dot. Fantasy is the orange stuff, I think. The Liver River. Is a red river that flows into Kool Aid Lake. The Runny River are the purple dots. I don't know why they're dots if it's a river. And then we got Lactose Lake, which is the white dot. And I don't know why it's a dot if it's a lake, but we'll okay. go with it. How do you balance your commitment to the communist ideology with the pragment prag? Matic challenges of governing a diverse and complex society. You know, you know, I just I start off by saying this country is the best. You know, as DJ Khaled says, we the, the best. best. Um, but uh, <laughs> <laughs> what is your response of the black nose gorilla three sixty no scoping the white nose gorilla? You know, we are constantly fighting this war. Um, the first response of Yuhu Island, we constantly strive. To beat this war. Um, the Black Nose Gorilla, their gang leader is Gojira2678. He is a top predator, and every day we strive to take him down and de defeat this, this, this force that is oppressing our, our nation. And, uh, you know, like The Rock said, it's about, about drive, it's about, about power. We stay hungry, we devour. We put in the work, we put in the hours, and we take with hours. And that's, that's really the motto for us, and that's what we strive to do every day. Here on Yuhu Island. I'm gonna eat, yeah. Yummy, yummy, gonna eat, yeah. So Landon, today I've come to ask you two important questions to our community. Because I know that if our community doesn't know this, they'll be troubled by our leaders. Me, you, and Jammy. So my first question is to you. Is what is your view on human rights in Yuhu Island? That's a that's a good question. I think we kind of have like a North Korea mixed China view on human rights, but like it's kind of in that middle where like men they get paid a lot more and like they're just better, but like women they're there to help and to be a part of like <laughs> the community and to like yeah so like. They cook the food, we make the money. Oh, I, 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 I think that will anger some of our community members, but I agree totally yeah, but with what you have said. I yeah, what our community members think. Okay. To our we will run it communistically if we want to. So Landon, how do you make Whoville a better place due to all the gang fights and crime there? Yeah, broski, that's a, that's a great question there. Um, it's a, it's a rough place there, but like... There's some, if you really just relax while we're having a serious conversation there, that's really disrespectful. Okay. But, so there, there's some people that like, hey, Khaled, I don't need child for a soldier boy. They bring a lot of tourism to the area. But I don't think there's really any way that we can stop the gang fights and the violence there. It's just that rough of a place. There's no turning back. 
Yeah, that, that was a good question. Next time, don't interrupt me. Uh, I'm sorry. It's all good. <laughs> yummy, yummy, cheeky. Yeah! In my Tim, do you love your country? No. Tummy party party. Yeah! In my tummy cheese. Dougie, what is your opinion on Yuhu Island? Yuhu Island, oh my goodness. That is my favorite place ever. Really love to go there. It's really fun. It's like a very good vacation spot. Overall, I would totally recommend it. Thank you. In my tummy party party. Danny, what is your opinion on Yuhu Island? It's weird and I don't know what that is. Oh. <coughs> um is that all you gotta say? Um, I don't know. Oh. I don't know what island or whatever that is. Oh. Okay, thank you so much. My tummy juice! Yeah! In my tummy! Yeah! What is your opinion on Yuhu Island? I think Yuhu Island is very beautiful, and there are many chocolate milk stands everywhere for like the best Yuhu chocolate milk out there. They have many delicious chocolate milk fries. Oh, yes. Yeah. Thank you so much, Nathan. Yeah, you're welcome. My pleasure. Yeah! So, Jaden, as one of our citizens, what is your opinion on Yuhu Island? My opinion on Yuhu Island is that it's really good. Uh, there's this one place that I like to... Is they sell cheese and it's like really good. Oh, the yep. best is the fancy um moldy cheese. Yep, my personal favorite. Yep, and the climate's really good. Oh, the climate. Yep. And I like <coughs> the superiors. What did you say? Sorry. I like the superiors. Uh, yes, I totally agree. Thank you so much. That was really inspirational. You're welcome. Of course. <laughs> This is Gibraltar, and this is our number one distribution center on medical marijuana. We have multiple flavors like blueberry, lemon, papas fritas, and chava chip frappuccino to stimulate your brain when driving in Gibraltar. All our farmers are eagerly trained professionals, and we do not abuse them. Now remember kids, this is all for medicinal purposes. Hurra, please send help. <laughs> This is the beautiful area of wait, Albuquerque, and you know we have a lot of businesses here. We have the lucky, the this lucky thing right there. We got, we got Pollut store. We have lots of, lots of locations here, and it's a place where a lot of people live. You know, this is the district where entertainment and uh, family life. They, uh, don't mind the huge creature in the background, but this is a amazing place for families and people. This is a big tourist site right here. Here we got the famous arcade here. This is where all the 13-year-old children spend their birthday money playing games that are rigged, you know, and uh, you see there's people there enjoying their, uh, their time there, and yeah. So this is Whoville. Um, it's a very friendly place. Sometimes it has its pros and cons, and we're very, we're very nice here. Sometimes um, I'll be showing you where our fruits distribution center is and all the good stuff. Oh, that's one of our citizens, I, I think, or an alien. I don't know. And we're, we're just very, we're very nice, you know. Look, see, fire department. We're very well built. As you can see, there's some people playing like laser tag over there and yeah oh oh yep there's more laser tags over there now um yep and this is where our fruits would be but we're too poor and we're out of stock and we're so cheap to the point where we have no cashiers we need people please come <laughs> Jump to
Julio is a very good place for fishing. We have the highest degrees of fish catching available, but beware there are dangerous animals, like the coconut crab. Every year the bees from Bee Bay come join forces with the humans from Julio and together. Defeat the King Coconut Crab Woe prevents our young fishers from learning fishing by eating them. After absolutely mulling it down with the bees and beating it up with the mulberry tree like kind, 1001 Arabian Nights. You collect his coconut droppings, which then can be used to be thrown at the stump snail no. Watch me speedrun his funeral. <laughs>